float. As easy as a wooden boat. Iron. Uh, Interesting. What madness do you spout, devil? On your words, pig. Uh, yeah, yes. Let's see. I need something to explode that. that. Strange word. Is that a word? We should on love and do fundia. down here. Was just a drinking, uh, talking pig. Anyway, um, if I get down here, right, gotta climb back up. Challenge out this way. Good day. 
What is your name? I'm Avon, of the Raven Clan. And are you a flighter? When the mood strikes. Do you wish to flight with me? Oh, no, certainly not. I don't engage in such things. Haven't a head for it. My brother, however, he is quite proficient. Ah, then you wish to compete with me. I should mention, my brother has taken a strict vow of silence. If you wish to flight, I will translate and relay his verses. I think I understand. Good. So, he's not the one Mark, flying? To those gathered I'm round, confused. wave your hands and rejoice. I shall trounce this poor fool without use of my voice. Such is his challenge. Do you wish to face him? I'll happily sure. challenge you. Sorry, him. Here you are, my bet. Good. Now remember, it is not me you are flighting. I am but a conduit for his words. I will keep this well in mind. Good. He is ready. Come you closer, friend Eivor, and lend me your ear. The most cutting of flights from my mouth you'll not hear. But by proxy I'll call you a milksop and boor. Though you speak through another, your flighting's still poor. Your body is withered, your garments absurd. I'll topple you over with nary a word. I'm devoted to flights, though to silence avowed. You're a simpleton and a fool, and you should never be proud. Your visage is ghastly. I'm cowed by your stink. I should like to write more, but you're not worth the ink. So, a last parting phrase. You're as dim yeah, as they come. Up. I will easily crush you beneath my thumb. Your pitiful flighting has left me quite cold. So leave here with speed once you've paid me your gold. You've bested me, but I'll return. All right. Let me try this again. The failure Eivor returns. Will you compete again? I will. Yeah, yeah. Here you are, my bet. Good. Now remember, it is not me you are flighting. I will keep this well at. Good. Come you closer, friend Eivor, and lend me your ear. The most cutting of flights from my mouth you'll not hear. But by proxy, I'll call you a milksop and boor. Though you speak through another, your flighting's still poor. Your body is withered, your garments absurd. I'll topple you over with nary a word. I'm devoted to flights, though to silence avowed. Though you choose to be quiet, your folly is loud. Oh my! <laughs> All right, that's where I messed your up on that one. Your visage is ghastly. I'm cowed by your stink. I should like to write more, but you're not worth the ink. So, a last parting phrase. You're as dim as they come. With such drivel to speak, I see why you keep mum. 
Very fine work. As an impartial observer, I must say you won. Thank you. My brother has a few parting words. You have bested me squarely and thus won the day. So take what you've earned now and hurry away. I will. Farewell to you both. Alright. You 